Okay, if you want to generate stunning visuals in English and also in your preferred language, then this video is for you. I will show you one tool which is absolutely for free till date of this recording using which you will be able to generate stunning visuals and that too in your preferred languages. So if you follow my mouse, I'm in Google homepage and here if I just type napkin.ai, then you will be able to see this type of an interface. I earlier recorded one detailed video in my channel using Napkin AI, but recently they introduced a couple of new features which will be really helpful to generate certain visuals. Let me show you very quickly. So if you are first time using napkin.ai, then you can click on sign in and you will be able to use your Google credentials to log in. I already have one ID created. So once I'll click on sign in, then it will allow me to log in. Let me click on it and then I'll be in my homepage. Currently it's loading and you can see this is the first look you will be able to get. So to start with, let me generate some content first and after that we'll be able to produce some visuals and then we'll see that how the language options of those visuals can be changed. If you come here and the left side, you'll be able to see there is one button here that is new napkin. If you click on that, you'll be able to get two different options. One is draft with AI and second one is blank napkin. If you already have certain text, you can use this blank napkin option and there you'll be able to paste your own text. But if you want napkin AI to generate your text for you, then you can click on the first option. Let me click on that. You can see this is a similar type of an interface what we see in different LLM models like ChatGPT, Copilot and other tools similar way the prompt option is here now there are certain ready-made prompts are also available for your use so if I just use any of them maybe the first one the best practices for a hiring interview if I click on that then this particular text will be pasted here and I can click on continue then what it will do it will generate that content for me you can see it is generating that content for us and then we'll be able to see a full document once the text generation will get completed now you can see it is completed what we'll do we'll select this entire text from point number one to point number ten now after you selected the text if you click on this blue icon then it will help you to generate the visuals let me click on that this part you can see it is working and it will generate the visuals for us there are multiple different options in the left side and if you just mouse over you will be able to see all those options now let me scroll down and try to find out something as per my liking and maybe this one if i just use this one as a sample so once you click on that you will be able to see multiple different other options i'll select the first one and then this particular visual will be available for my use now there are few options napkin ai recently added if i click on this particular visual again in this change style i'll be able to change my visual styles i'll be getting all those options which were available few minutes back before we selected this particular style right so if you again want to change you can do it from here earlier this option was not available next one is that you can select the aspect ratio what are the sizes you are looking for you can click on that it can be 16 cross 9 4 by 5 or 1 is to 1 everything you can select from here let me select this 16 is to 9 option and then another option is that is background color if you want any background color on this visuals that you can select from here maybe this gray tone if you want you can select from here what i'll do i'll not select anything because i'm good with this white one and then i'll go ahead so before i move to the next point one announcement I'm in process to record one comprehensive course on generative AI. Chat GPT, Google Gemini, Microsoft Copilot, Claude, all those prominent LLM applications will be covered there in a comprehensive way. I have added one link in the description below. If you want to enjoy a 70% discount coupon, once the course will be launched, please fill out that particular form. I'll be sending those coupon codes to your email ID once the course will be live. Now let me show you how can you generate these things in your language. If you come here in the settings icon, one option is there, generate visuals in and there is a drop down. You will be able to select your language from here. They have already made multiple languages available. I can see my mother tongue is also available here. But what I'll do, I'll select Hindi for now because good amount of my subscribers speak Hindi. So what I'll do, I'll click on Hindi. And then what will happen down the line, whatever the visuals I will generate 
those will be generated in Hindi. So you can select your own preferred language and you will be able to see. Now let me do one thing. If I just select these four paragraphs and I generate another visual, if I click on that, it started generating and this time it will generate in Hindi. Now you can see visuals have been generated. Now the text are mentioned in Hindi and you can select any of the option. All those visuals are Hindi. So if you are looking for some content in your preferred language, then this is the option you can use. This is a newly introduced feature in Napkin AI and it will be really, really helpful for certain scenarios. Now let me show you one final thing. If you want to download this particular visual, then what can you do? Let me select this particular option and now my visuals are ready. If you click on download, you'll be getting multiple different options. If you want to download this image for a light mode presentation or the dark mode, if you are creating any PowerPoint presentation which is in dark mode and you want to utilize this image there, then you can select dark mode from here. You can also toggle between light and dark both. Second one is you want that background background on or off. If you are looking for a visual without any background, then you can keep it off and you can also select the resolution 1x, 2x or 3x. I'll click on 3x and I'll click on download. Now this particular visual will get downloaded. You can see this 264 KB size file and if I just double click, this particular file will open and now you will be able to see this is downloaded but without any background. So this is the way you will be able to generate your content in your preferred language and you will be also able to download. So these are few new features which have been now recently introduced by Napkin AI, which I thought of covering in this channel. If you want to know how to use Napkin AI end to end in detailed way, then check out this video to know everything about it.